Do you want to be able to control the screen of other users, redirect them to a fake version of a well-known website or just annoy your family? Beef has the techniques to achieve this. First of all, we must visit linnode.com and spin up a VM application that is dedicated to Beef. I am just going to show you how to purchase a Beef web server online. Go to Create Node or click on Create from the drop-down. Rather than build your own, you can visit the marketplace for pre-built application servers. Scroll down for Beef. Once you have selected Beef, begin to fill out some of the simple details for the application. This will include the sudo account, the geographical location of the server, the name and how much you are willing to spend monthly. To save on cost, it is best to select the shared CPU as this is purely for testing purposes right now. Leave the rest of the settings as default and then click on Create Node. The node will now be running and you can SSH to the root of this VM using the CMD prompt. Paste the details from Linode in and type in the password of the account you have previously set up. Within the asterisks below, you can see the link for the app URL, so copy this and head to a browser. Paste this URL in, and it will bring up the Beef application in a browser with a username and password prompt. You can now log into the Beef application and begin using it. The home page shows some text regarding how to get started with Beef. There is a link for an advanced dummy website that you can send as a link to your friends as a test. Click on this link and it will show a default website. Copy the URL and for now, I have a Kali Linux VM, I have set up as the target. Paste the URL into there and you can see, Beef will see this web session startup as one of its online hooked browsers. From there, we are able to view this session and any details about the target machine and browser. It is being shown here under the current browser tab. It shows detailed information about your target and what they are using. With the next technique, we are just sending a cheeky alert to our target, which is more for a warning. This is not a serious hack, more bravado that you are letting people know you are out there. If you scroll down to create alert dialog and type in a message, it will automatically flash up on the screen of your target. The alert box pops up on the browser of the Linux VM and can easily be cancelled. The ethical hacker has found a way to locate you. The next technique is a little more serious, as you could give up your credentials without thinking, so please be wary. We are going to redirect the user to what looks like an authentic Google login page. So here, we are sending the user to our dummy beef site again, so that we can get a hook into their browser. Once we are in, we are going to click on the social engineering folder and scroll down to Google Phishing. Once we have clicked on this, as we already have a connection to the target, a Google login page has appeared on their device. If the user has a Google account, let's be honest here, most of us do, then the user may log into the site. Without thinking, they type in their credentials, but nothing happens. A genuine Google prompt appears, and the target is completely unaware. However, if you go back to Beef, the command results displays the username and password clearly. For the last part, we are going to do something a little amusing and redirect the target to an awful YouTube video. Depending on how much you dislike your target, we are going to redirect their browser to Rick Astley's Never Gonna Give You Up. That's really going to wind someone up. You can see the option, Redirect Browser, Rick Roll. And the result is beautiful. Okay, that's quite enough of that. Here is a useful tip for when you are creating URLs to send to the target. Visit tinyurl.com and copy and pass the long URL into here and shorten it. The target user will find this more believable. Thank you for joining the G-Man channel on a brief introduction to the Browser Exploitation Framework project. Like, share and subscribe to our channel and see you again soon.